I'm 85 and I wouldn't have reached this age if I lived anywhere else but here. If I hadn't got into housing, um, I would have had to double up my income. I would have ended up back on the streets and I would have ended up dead. If I wasn't living here, I would be living with my parents in Florida and I would be unhappy and they would be unhappy. When I got sick and lost my job and didn't have a pension at that time, I'd been on the street in a, in a, with a shopping cart pushing all my goods. Everyone needs somewhere to call home. Housing is more than just a roof over someone's head. By supporting community-based affordable housing, the government gives people the opportunity to break the poverty cycle. I was supporting myself on the streets, doing drugs, and my son was dying of leukemia. I got out of jail three days before he died. And in those three days of him, me being with him, he made me pinky swear on his deathbed not to work, not to do drugs, and to change. Being accepted into housing has helped me. It's opened up a lot of doors for me. It's given me support with other people that live in my community, and I consider my apartment building my community. So, you know, it, it, it was the best thing that could have ever happened to me. Research has proven that housing is an essential determinant of health. It is key to the vitality of Ontario's communities. When I got very, very sick uh, from an operation, I, uh, I got really worried. Uh, I didn't know how, I wasn't getting a pension at that point, so I didn't know what I'd do. The reason why I like living here is the sense of community. Uh, I don't feel like I'm living in an apartment. I became suddenly ill with a neurological disease. Um, it was completely unexpected, and thank God I had disability insurance. But regardless of the insurance, I needed uh, a place to live that had the potential of being one day uh, uh, supported housing. I like living here very, very much because of my friends and my family and how my toys are and because I'm close to my school. But Ontario's community-based affordable housing sector is at a critical juncture. Waiting lists are long. Over the past 10 years, 13,000 rental units have been lost. Rents are high and the older housing stock is decaying. This combination means there is not enough supply to meet the demand. There's no way that I could live anywhere else. And I think there's, I'm not the only one. There's a lot of people in the same predicament as I am. And I think that sub, subsidized housing is the way to go. And I wish the government would decide to do more of it. It's about time. The government must act now to reverse this situation and plan for the future because everyone needs somewhere to call home.